unable to be bounded. It's so simple. You can't box this in any way. You can't bound it. You can't put a concept or idea on it. No groupings or categorizations. None. That's the addictive tendency of the contraction. Always grasping and clinging to making boxes as its defense mechanism from the boundlessness that it always already is. So the contracted energy uses boxes and concepts and bounds to shield itself, to try to repel itself away from the boundlessness that it already is. And it's hopeless. So it's better to just fearlessly identify as this boundlessness, as this everythingness, as this nothingness, as this wholeness. Everything is you, this boundlessness. And it's unconditional love and it's unconditionally free. No conditions, no boxes, no bounds, no concepts. And finally, the lasting contentment, well-being, satisfaction, joy, humor, Peace, all the good things that are so deeply sought and desired, but they cannot be found from boxes and bounds. The game of positioning self and others and separation and lack and need and validation, meaning and purpose, Becoming, self-actualization, attainments, goals. I will be happy when... Mm -mm. Boundlessness, here, now, this, simply this. No added concepts. No added ideas. Just the freedom that is already there right now. It's already there right now. It's already unbound freedom there right now. that unconditional love right there, right now, and everywhere, forever. Hmm.